What is up guys, it's me, Vixal123 with some more Battlefield 4 gameplay. You guys have been asking for this so much and of course, how could I, how could I refuse to give you guys some more BF4 goodness. This is actually some PS4 gameplay as well, so some PS4 goodness. This is probably the last PlayStation 4 Battlefield 4 pre-release gameplay I will post. This was again recorded at the press event in Stockholm about three weeks ago. And uh, yeah, it's some M16 tearing up on Flood Zone, like I said. I believe the setup I'm using is the Coyote Red Dot site. Then also the Heavy Barrel, the Potato Grip, and the Tri-Beam Laser just for good measure. And this gameplay is probably my best one that I got on the PS4. So save the best till last. That's how we do. I do hope you guys are going to enjoy this one. This weapon is still a beast. I, I must say it is still a beastly weapon. Most of the time, one or two burst. If they're really far away, it's going to be a three burst. Look at that guy get just laying to waste and his friend too. And there's another one out there. There's another two out there. I didn't know what to do. I'm switching to the pistol. And uh, actually, my main problem during this whole game was ammo. I mean, it was a good game, something like 25 and 5, or 25 and 3, or something around that number. However, um, the main issue being that I ran out of ammo quite a lot, and uh, my teammates weren't really dropping much more for me to uh, use, so I was, uh, I was often running around looking for ammo. Actually, that guy did take quite a lot of shots, but again, they weren't perfect bursts. There is a bit of climb at distance, but this thing is a lot of fun. It takes quite a while to unlock online. So, uh, you know, something something to look forward to in the future. But look at these guys drop to the ground. But unfortunately, I'm out of ammo right here. So, uh, I'm, I'm panicking a little bit. I'm like, dude, support. Ammo me, please. Ammo. I can have some ammo. <laughs> Oh, uh, it was it was not good. I actually had to had to switch to the magnum to pop that guy. I should have taken his kit, but I was getting shot at, so I'm just like, you know what, I'm gonna I'm gonna stay safe, play it safe. There's this guy too. What's he doing? So anyway, the game mode right here is team deathmatch on flood zone. And I love these smaller modes on Battlefield 4. Although if I had to play, you know, Conquest or Obliteration or something a little bit bigger on any of the maps, I'd definitely pick Flood Zone because you can get away from the kind of vehicle manslaughter by uh, hopping up in the buildings um, on the rooftops. It's, you know, it's all guns. Look at that. You can hear me shouting, I need ammo. And no one would help me out. So I was in a bit of trouble. I think I just decided to Rambo it right here. I was like, you know what? What was I even trying to do? I think I just gave up there. Big Diablo is going to take me down. I think it was just over. I was like, this is not happening. So anyway, while we're watching some Battlefield 4 and on the topic of BF4, one thing I'd like to know from you guys is what kind of content would you like to see me make on the full game now that it's out? I covered a lot of stuff on the alpha, on the beta, and... Uh, now on next gen consoles on the final build of the game actually speaking of next gen consoles next week i'm gonna get to capture some of the second assault and china rising dlc maps on xbox one so uh if there's anything specific you would like to see within those any particular maps um any particular style of gameplay any weapons you know you let me know any vehicles this is your channel as much as mine. I make the videos for you guys to watch. And uh, if you didn't watch them, then perhaps I wouldn't be making them. So uh, it's, it's, it's a bit of a bit of a cycle that is uh, always nice to keep going. So yeah, going to be having that sort of stuff going on next week. There's actually been an awesome, awesome response to the footage on this channel so far. So uh, I think some live stuff would definitely be in order at some point in the future, as you guys may have seen, I've been doing a lot of Call of Duty Ghost stuff. I'm going to be uh, blending more GTA 5 and uh, Battlefield 4 stuff back into that just to keep it nice and varied, just to keep myself um, entertained while doing it. Because my uh, the way I always look at it is if I'm not having fun making a video, then who's going to have fun watching it? You know, if I'm not having fun in the game I'm playing or, um, you know, the footage I'm talking over, it's like, why would anyone else? Right here, actually, those guys were non-stop on that corner. I was just flat down. I was just planking. I did not want anything bad to happen. And actually, again, I'm getting close to running out of ammo. People always shout at me for kind of reloading when I've only wasted a few bullets out of my clip. But I always think to myself, I'd rather run out of ammo than, you know, when I'm doing nothing. Rather than run out of ammo while I'm shooting someone. You know, my clip empties while I'm shooting someone because that could be... That could be a pretty disastrous situation. There's a little saying, an empty gun 
it's not a gun if it don't have ammo then it's not gonna do much it was actually uh i think that's actually another thing i like about this map just the ability to flank it really does you know with the levels there's always action if you want action you just go to the top floor i was a little confused by that mortar by the way if you want action you go to the rooftops and you just take 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 part in the carnage but if not you can just drop onto the lower floors and you can get around pretty easily without getting taken down so that's always useful now i'm gonna be honest right here there's two and a half minutes left in this video and i have no idea what to say it's kind of been like that for the last 30 seconds or so but i didn't want to i didn't want to make it obvious but perhaps i should have done because i said everything i really wanted to say why did this gameplay have to be so long eight minutes long let's see what we're doing we're dropping med kits we're, we're destroying guys. I mean, the M16, actually, it, you know, seems like something you'd want to use at a long range, especially with the burst fire. But if you just spam it, you just mash it up at close range, people are going to drop. Look, look at that. I get the first kill, just a face melt from point blank. Then I drop that guy all the way in the distance. So, very versatile weapon. That's a prime example of that for you guys. I nearly got hit in the face by a plastic deck chair there. Can you imagine if that had, that had killed me? Fatal deck chair to the face. I mean, plastic splinters with explosives could be dangerous. Getting taken down by a deck chair. Can't think of many worse things. So anyway, we're down on the ground floor. I'm, I'm just like going with this, by the way. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just rolling with it. I can't climb through the market stores because, you know, market stores are actually a really good defense. They're used in the military these days. Basically, it's kind of portable barricades. They just put them like down the middle of that street there. And it basically meant I couldn't get through. You know, it slowed me down, gave the enemy's forces, you know, time to advance forward. And it really just kind of ruined the whole flow of what I was doing there. So uh, would definitely recommend usage of uh, market stalls. That guy did not expect it. See, this is actually what I was talking about, the flanking earlier on. Forget the whole market store thing. And then right here, I mess up. First of all, I dropped that guy. It's like, you're trying to shoot me? Nah, you're dead. And then I accidentally <laughs> opened the PS PS4 menu. I minimized it. But it's all right, I came straight back. You guys probably weren't supposed to see that. Don't report me to the Sony police. Patrick back, takes me down. What a champion. If you guys know who he is, you'll know he's a legend. And, uh, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. We've got one, one more life in the game. Down on the ground floor again. Probably going to be avoiding those market stores, man. Don't want to be messing around with those. Take the stairs. Take the stairs. Always a safe option. Map isn't actually flooded because this is... Uh, it can't be flooded on the small game modes. There you go. Bet you already knew that. And uh, we're going to drop one guy. And I think it's over. And a quick little scan downstairs, you know, just in case. And uh, he's going to be behind me. I can tell the future. Shoot that guy in the back, though. Obviously. Obvious headshot bonus. That's the thing I love about the burst fire. The climb usually just drives it into their head. This guy's trying to shoot me in the back. Boom. Done. There we go. BF4. PS4. TDM. 25 and something. 5. Something along those lines. Pretty cool. Pretty fresh. If you want to check out some more Battlefield 4 videos, you have loads of them on the screen right here. Please click some of these outros. It takes me ages to put these annotations on screen i said outros i meant annotations it takes me ages to put these annotations on screen i have to drag them on one by one and then usually like about 17 people click them and i'm like why did i even bother so feel free to click some feel free to subscribe if you haven't already there's plenty of battlefield stuff if you're new around here if you miss some of that stuff watch it it's worth doing if you're still here you're obviously a little bit crazy so you know there's there's cool stuff there's all this stuff going on you know it's not just I mean, this video is over. I'm just talking. I'm just rambling over this, you know, static outro screen. There are actual other, you know, full videos that are actually, actually, you know, have, have meaning more than just an outro screen. So, yeah, check them out. I'll see you guys soon.